Mr. Firebird. Hi, Mr. Firebird. Welcome, Butt Butt. I was just putting the finishing touches on my time portal. Wow, a real time last portal? Time I went Where can you go in it, Mr. Firebird? Nowhere, nowhere at all. I don't think. You see, it's not meant for actual travel, but it gives you a way to see into the past and the future through the time portal, like a TV set, only what you're seeing is real. Wow, that's neat. Why don't you just use As a matter of fact, travel. I was just about to fire it up for the very first time. Here, I'll show you. Great. And then I can show you my history report and my new school supplies. <laughs> it's like, time travel's cool and all, but check out my lunchbox. Oh, what was I thinking? I need a coin to start the washing machine. Guess I'm fresh out. Hey, I think I've got something that will solve the problem. Yep, and if you didn't do that now, you'd have to work all the way back to Pup. Here's the coin, Mr. Coin. Firebird. Ah, this is not a mere coin, Putt Putt. It is the key to great knowledge. Dude, you're the one who made your time machine coin operator. The washing machine is providing the perfect ratio between the inverted subspace bubble frequency, the molecular torque, and the spin cycle. <laughs> Holy goddamn! This shouldn't be happening! <laughs> Way too smooth for that to be accidental. Hep, no! <laughs> this is not good at all, Pot Pot. My calculations show that until everything is brought back to the present time, I won't be able to shut the portal. Oh, well, good. You better not close the time portal, my dog. Run. I'll go in and find everything. Once you find all your things, we can close this time portal for good. I don't see why not. I mean, you be careful, Putt Putt, and good luck! Wow! It's like a science fiction movie, except I have a feeling that this is reality. These must be the four places where Pep and all my things landed. I wonder where I should go first. Uh, I don't know. You have the past, the past, the very past, and the future. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! This must be the age of the dinosaurs! Wowie zowie! It's a real live Brachiosaurus! Hello! Ms. Brachiosaurus, and who or what in the primordial ooze are you? I'm Putt Putt, or what and I've come from the future, Miss Brachiosaurus! Sure you have, honey. Have a nice time while you're here in the past. Thanks! So, exactly what year is this? Oh, sorry, let me... I have to... I w and then, let's go back. Hi, Miss Brachio... Oh, sorry. 
Thanks. So now I'm. Uh, Hello, uh, I'm Pud Pud. Do you need some help? Yes. But first, you gotta tell me what in the heck is a putt putt? I never laid eyes on anything quite like you before. I'm a con, and I'm visiting from the future. Whoa! Imagine that! I'm Will. Glad to meet you. Hey, putt. It's like this is what I turn into. Figure out how to move this basic pile of rocks. Then I can build me a bridge and go home. I'd be happy to help you, Will. All I have to do is figure out how to do it. Uh, just full speed ahead! Ugh. Yes! What do we got? Fantastic. Ooh, we need Stupendous. a square. Put, you cars from the future sure know how to fix your basic bridge. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah. Let's see. I believe it's. I... It... There we go. Will, we guess what? I found a rock, and I think it will fit in the hole in the bridge. Well, what do you know? Bridge. Excellent. Fantastic. Thanks, a gun. Still <laughs> getting Well, I'm homeward bound. Come visit any old time you like. Alright, so now let's see what we have going on here. Oh, mm -hmm. Look at. Oops, sorry. Go a little bit down. Okay, go a little bit down. Ah. Oh, just a little lower. Yes. Yes. Ooh, now go a bit to the right. Oh, yes. Now go down. Just a bit. Dude, you are dying of getting uncomfortably oh. down. Ooh, now go a bit to the right. Um, okay, I was gonna say, why is it not letting me go right? Ah. Oh. Yes! Oh, that's it. Oh, that's so much better. Thank you. You're welcome. I was happy to help. Mind if I drive over your tail to the other side? As far as I'm concerned, Putt-Putt, you could drive on me all day and night. Be my guest. Okay, so nothing here, so... Hello? Where are my... Oh, okay, so that, that is a clue for what we need to do. Okay, and that is another clue for what we need to do. Okay, nothing going on over here. Nothing going on over here. Oh, here go. I believe it's the museum. That's the stone bull. Welcome. Hey. Here's an ancient food container for you, artifact. It's a really old stone bull. I got it from a wheel way back in the dinosaur ages. The dinosaur ages, you say? How amazing. This will now be the oldest item we have in our museum. Here. Take the lunchbox. Thanks. Great. I got my Smokey the Fire Engine lunchbox back. Now all I have to do is get Pep, my calculator, and my history report. So Mr. Firebird can close the time portal. One primitive Piece of crank telephone from 1882. Wow! Look at... Okay, nothing going 
on here. It's a... It's a rope. Any... There. Toby, I found a rope, and I think it's just the thing to do the trick. I thought you'd be the kind of cowpoke who'd be handy with a rope trick. <laughs> cowpoke. <laughs> In business, I thanks to you, to Mr. Junior Conductor. Anytime you want to take a ride around the tracks, just hop on my flat nice car. I'll give you a ride you won't soon forget. Five thanks, cents. Toby. I'm sure I'll take you up on it. It sounds like fun. All right, let's hop on. Well, Buckaroo, where do you want old Toby to take you? All aboard for Hubcap Hill, Tire Flat's very own. Okay. Next. Next. Hubcap Hill. Back to Hubcap Hill. It's my cap. Ugh. And you want the star. Which key should I use? Well, what do you know? It's. Hmm. Seriously, Putt Putt, grab your freaking calculator! Excellent! I've got my calculator back! Now all I have to do is get Pep and my history report. So Mr. Firebird can close the time portal. Uh, Alright, let's go this way. Hot and... Okay, uh... There are no paw prints there, so and it's not... Tire. Yep. And then... Go back to Dinosaur Land. Whoops, not that way. Sorry I gave up one of your bowls. Okay, now I'm gonna use the hay. I'm gonna use the hay. Mm -hmm. One more time. No! Alright, now we just need to find Pep. And there's only one more place he could be. Wait, where you're heavy. Excuse me, do you need some help? Mom, you are certainly the fancy carriage. I'm not a carriage exactly. I'm a car from the future. My name's Putt Putt. I'm very happy to meet you, Putt Putt. I'm Princess Chassie, and this is my best friend and loyal subject, Woodward. We have been out collecting wood for the blacksmith when a horrible rainstorm hit. We were charging back to the capital as fast as we could when I hit a bump and my wheel fell right off in the middle of the road. Well, maybe I can help you figure out a way to get that wheel back on. That would be wonderful, Putt-Putt. Now I wonder how we should do this. Okay, Princess Chassie, here's the plan. You lift up your friend Woodward, and I'll slip on his wheel. It would be my pleasure. Okay, I don't think oh my to hold goodness gracious sakes. Good thanks to both of you. You're welcome. Now I must hurry back to the castle. My father, King Chariot, is expecting me for story time. And I have to return with the blacksmith's firewood. Perhaps I'll see you later, Pet Pet. Bye! Oh, that's where I get, that's where I would get the oh. Well, uh, it's not the end, because we, we still have to go here to find a dog. This is some castle! Yes, it is! Only the rains have rested the gates shut. We need something to help loosen them up. That's what I think. I think I have something that will work. This should help open that rusted gate. A thousand and one.
fun thank yous, Putt-Putt. Now we won't be late for story time. All right, let's go in and let's try to find a dog. Pep, <laughs> I found you! Yikes, don't jump, boy. That could be dangerous. Here, maybe I can reach you. I can't do it, Pep. Sorry. Don't worry. I'll find something to get you down from there. I promise. <laughs> hey, uh, let me see. Maybe it's... Thank you, Trent. Here go. For golly sakes. There you go, that's what I need. Hello. Now, aren't you the cutest little guy on four wheels? What can I do to help you? My name's Putt-Putt, and I'm visiting from the past. I, forgot. I, I was the... just checking out this balloon thingy. First things first, you can call me Miss Electra. And second, this must be your lucky day. We're giving those balloon makers away free. It's our anniversary. Makes as many balloons as your little heart desires. Gee, thanks. Well, would you look at that? Okay. Now we go back to the... Sorry about that. Grab onto it, quick boy! This is like a little balloon mini game. I guess Pep, when you're not. I'm so okay. glad I finally got you back. <laughs> Hot ziggity, this is great. It looks like I got everything I needed to get. Come on, Pep. Let's travel back through time to Car Town and tell Mr. Firebird. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Guess what? I did it! I did it! I found all my things! And Pep, too! Congratulations, Putt Putt! I knew you would! Now I can finally show you my new school supplies! Excellent, Putt Putt! But first, I must close the time portal for good! We don't need any more disasters. Disasters? I don't know about that, Mr. Firebird. I guess it all depends on how you look at it. Between you and me, I thought time traveling was the best fun ever. Well, I'm glad you had so much fun, Putt Putt. But according to my calculations, you're going to be late for school unless you hurry. Yikes, you're right, Mr. Firebird. I'll show you my report later. Here's my history report. <laughs> Now, let me tell you what I learned. Sorry, I thought I had something there. <laughs> Alright, so that was Papa Travels to Through Time. Uh, after that, let's see. Next up will be Free Fish 3, the case of the stolen conch shell. Sorry about your friend. There you go. I hope you guys enjoy watching.